back to Book for Life. Today I'll be doing a book review on a book called Scarescape by Sam Fisher. This book is about a boy named Martin Clay who has to move to a new town, a new school, and a new creepy abandoned house because of his dad's job as an astronomer. Martin Clay is a big, huge fan of the com the monster comic books called Scarescape. He's the biggest fan and has almost all of the toys and collectibles you can have with it. So when he, his sister Melissa, and his brother James stumble upon a buried ancient gargoyle that says, if you pull its three fingers and make a wish, the wish will come true. He wishes for his scarce scrape toys to look more realistic. Kind of a wasteful wish, if you ask me. His sister wishes for a giant closet. And his brother's wish is unknown. It doesn't get revealed to the end of the book. But because the gargoyle is composed of dark magic, things don't go out as it's supposed to be. Instead of getting more realistic toys, Martin got Martin's toys became a lie which is bad because he has some of the most deadly collectibles ever. And instead of a giant closet, we also got an infinite closet that clothes can go all the way back to the Stone Age. And James, because nobody really knows his wish, he starts to act a little peculiar, throwing up yellow gas, eating rotten meat from a dumpster, and always rubbing his hands consistently. Things get really weird, and when all the monsters get loose into the entire town, things start, things start getting in trouble. Like, and two monsters stole about 300 cats, one monster almost blew up a house, and one tore up an attic. In order to reverse these wishes, they have to dig into the past of the comic book's writer John King, I think, Stephen, John King, and uncover the past and figure out, is he really dead? Who killed him? How did he die? And what are in his books? This is a decent book. I I personally did not like the book. It's 11 points on AR, it's on the fifth grade reading level. I didn't like the book, but that doesn't mean you did. Because it's actually a good concept. I just don't like these type of books. That's all I have for tonight, bye.